Hey guys, it's Joel at MetaGeek, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how to take a wireless packet capture in OS X for use with IEPA. So to get started, open up the spotlight by pressing Command Space on your keyboard and typing in Wireless Diagnostics, and uh, press Enter to open the application, and then click Window and click Sniffer. You could also press Command 6 on your keyboard uh, to, for a shortcut to that, so click on Sniffer and then select the channel that you want to perform a wireless packet capture on. Let's do channel 6, and then click Start. And it's going to ask you for your password here, so go ahead and type that in. And uh, you'll notice that the Wi-Fi menu up here turns into an icon with a little eye on it, and that's because the wireless adapter is now in monitor mode. It's listening uh, for everything that's going on in channel 6, and it's just capturing all those packets. So as soon as you're done, uh, click the Stop button, and you'll notice that OS X places a WCAP file on your desktop. And what I've done is I've just enabled desktop sharing between OS X and my virtual machine, which is in VMware Fusion. And so when we go over to my Windows virtual machine, we can see that there is that WCAP file right there. So if you open up IPA and click Open File, you can uh, open up that file, and IPA will parse out the packet, and or out, it'll parse out all the packets and open up the packet capture, and uh, you can look at it just like you had done this capture with an Air PCAP. Uh, the advantage of doing this is that uh, most uh, modern Macs, uh, pretty much anything 2014 and newer, I believe, maybe it's 2013 and newer, supports 802.11ac. So the MacBook Air and the MacBook Pro are very good capture options if you need to get 802.11ac packet captures. If you have further questions and if you want to learn more, go to support.metageek.com.